Hi guys, what's up and welcome back to my channel. That was cringy. I'm gonna try that again. Oh. Hi guys, what's up and welcome back to my channel. So today we are going to be doing a boxy charm unboxing. So about two months ago, I decided spur of the moment that I was going to subscribe to BoxyCharm because I saw an ad for it on Instagram and I was like, so I did my research. And I was first going to subscribe to Ipsy, but then I found out that Ipsy products are all like tester, tester size products. So they give you the small size and not the actual size. This is why I don't like wearing lip gloss. Everything gets stuck to it. So then I found out about BoxyCharm and BoxyCharm gives you actual sized products. And now we are here. So I've gotten my September and October BoxyCharms, uh, but I didn't really think to do a video on them, so I threw the box away. I didn't think it was going to be useful or helpful to review the products when I've already used them. This is my November BoxyCharm, but just a quick little explanation of what BoxyCharm is. It's a monthly subscription of $26 a month where they send you makeup products. They can send you anything from foundation to eyeshadow palettes to mascara to basically anything. Um, they can even send you skincare products and when you sign up they have you take a little quiz not necessarily a quiz, but they want to get to know what type of products you like and they ask you for your skin tone, whether you have warm undertones, cool undertones, so that they know what to send you. And then they um, have you order from like one to five of which products you want to get the most. So I put that I want to get eyeshadow palettes and different eyeliners and foundations the most in comparison to skincare products. So let's go ahead with the BoxyCharm November unboxing. So this is what it looks like. And they send you like cute little cards that tell you the products that you got. Right here, this tells me all of the products that I got, including their regular retail price. And then here's another card. They also got me the... I never know if it's Bika or Becca. Bika or Becca? I'm gonna go with Becca. So from Becca Cosmetics, they gave me an Ultimate Coverage 24 hour foundation um, tester. So these are little testers so I can see which shade I am. And here is all of the good stuff. I really enjoy the packaging of it because it's so cute and small. So the first one is the BoxyCharm brush set. Let's go ahead and open this bad boy. I have always wanted these type of brushes. They're so expensive. So this is what they look like. These are the brushes. I'm assuming they're by BoxyCharm, but oh my gosh, they're so soft. I've never used these brushes before, but I always see them on like those famous Instagram tutorials and I always want to try them, but they're so expensive. So, thanks BoxyCharm. Oh, yeah, that's nice. And next we have this Kypris, Kypris Antioxidant Dew. Um, I've never really used an antioxidant dew. This is what it looks like. Let's open it up. Oh. It's like a milky consistency. So when you squeeze the little syringe, it only squeezes out droplets. It won't squeeze out the whole thing no matter how 
hard you squeeze it. So that's kind of cool. It says on the back, made exclusively for BoxyCharm, not for resale. The next product that they sent me is this Dose of Colors liquid lipstick called Nude Mood. And it looks like this. It's really cute packaging. I've never had a Dose of Colors product, so this will be interesting to, sh to try. It's also a really nice color. That's a good color for fall, I would say. The next thing that they gave me was these two morning, morning and evening goggle eye mask. So the morning one is to brighten and protect your eye bags, I'm guessing. And then the evening one is to repair and relax. I've never really tried eye masks. I've tried face masks. So this will be fun to try. I've seen so many YouTubers and Instagram tutorials on using those eye masks before doing your makeup or something like that. So I'm definitely going to give this a try. And the last but not least thing that they sent me is the Celeste the Celestial Thunder eyeshadow palette and I'm a sucker for eyeshadow palettes I can never have enough eyeshadow colors there's always more colors that I want so this is perfect And time for the reveal. Oh. So this is what it looks like. Those are some pretty colors. I've been wanting a bright pink and a bright type of turquoise blue. So these are going to be fun. Should we swatch them? Should we swatch them? I'm going to swatch them. Okay, so first I'm going to swatch this one, which is called Eternal Light. So this is Eternal Light. That's what it looks like. Super pretty. Next, we're going to do Fireball. Fireball. This is, this is Fireball. So pretty. Next, we're going to do Black Matter. It's kind of a really dark, shimmery color. I'm not sure if I'll even use that shade, just because I personally don't like very dark makeup. The makeup I'm wearing right now is like the darkest that I'll go. So, we'll see if I ever use that. Oh, it's so pigmented. Oh, that's so pretty. Also, excuse my nails. I haven't got them done because I'm broke. Next, we're moving on to Zero Gravity, which is like a, it's like a grayish purple tone. It's very matte, too. It's okay. I'm, I'm not a fan of that one. And this one is called Lucid Dream. It's the hot pink. That's so nice. Next is Storm Dust. And I really like this one. It's like perfect shade for fall. Next, Lunar Eclipse. Lunar Eclipse is pretty good for fall as well. I would definitely use that. And then last but not least, Mystic Ice. Which is that very nice blue color. Oh, that's so pigmented. Do you guys see how pigmented that blue is? That's insane. So my entire November BoxyCharm came out to $195. And that's crazy because I only paid $26 a month. These products are probably going to last me a really long time. 
It's also opening up my makeup horizon because I don't, I don't use any of these brands. I only use like four different kind of brands. I really love BoxyCharm and I think I'm going to stay subscribed to them just because of how much makeup I get for such a little price. And I just wanted to come on here and share my thoughts on BoxyCharm. And I really hope that you guys maybe consider it if you're into makeup as much as I am. Um, but again, there's other subscriptions out there that might fit your needs more better if you're not into makeup as much. Um, so this is the end of the BoxyCharm unboxing. I really hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Um, makeup is super fun. And that's why I keep including it on my channel. So please comment down below if you have any thoughts on this video. Give it a thumbs up if you like it. And I hope to see you guys in my next video. Bye.